Hello everyone, this is me Sakya here and I'm back with another series of reads that I started. I will be doing this reading for every sign out there. So yeah, this reading is going to be for the sign of Aries. So Aries, let's find out whoever it is that you're dealing with. You really want to know if you and your specific someone are going to end up together, yes or no, then this reading is definitely going to help you find the answer to that. I will be adding oracle cards in this reading, so stay tuned. And uh, before I dive into the read, let me remind you, it is a general read, it may, it may not resonate with everyone out there. So always pick the signs and messages that resonate with you and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check the other services that I offer as well. So yeah, let's dive into the read and Aries. Let's find out whoever it is that you have on your mind that you really want to end up with. Let's find out. Will you guys end up together? Yep or no? Let's find out. Queen of Swords. Four of Cups, Three of uh, Pentacles, Wheel of Fortune, Ace of Swords, Knight of Swords, Six of Cups, you guys are soulmates, Empress, wow, Justice, I mean, they could do have the lovers, the answer is a big yes, um, I feel like, you know, um, I feel like, you know, there is going to be some sort of a mistake that that's going to be made by you or your person, um, which they are going to regret later on. And after that, I, I don't know whatever is happening between the two of you right now or whatever has happened, if that is something that has already happened. If your person left you for someone else or if you left your person for someone else, I feel like, you know, the regret is already pretty much there. If not, then the regret has to happen before you could come together uh, to start something beautiful again with each other, uh, knowing, understanding, having the clarity about this connection, uh, how beautiful this connection is, how beautiful it has always been how uh, somebody took it for granted, how somebody chose something wrong over it. I feel like, you know, there is going to be something like that happen. Uh, it's, uh, maybe it has already happened for some of you already. Like maybe you have experienced that kind of pain already in this connection. Um, and now maybe you're waiting for things to work out. Uh, but yes, I feel like you know, that's a must in this connection. Before you could come together, there is going to be some sort of a separation. Uh, between the two of you that's going to come through and if that has already happened then you are very close to get what you want with your person you are very close to be with the uh, to be reunited with them i would call it that way because i feel like you know it's a soulmate connection and i feel like you know for some of you in fact for majority of you you left this connection for something else um or if it is if it is a new connection maybe it is going to happen for some of you right now but I do see the U-turn there. I do see the person who's going to leave the other person is going to come back. And then, yes, you are going to end up together. Um, even though, uh, I, I don't think that the, the time apart is going to be long for a majority of you, but it can be. But I don't think so. I feel like, you know, uh, somebody's soon going to realize that it was a bad decision. And uh, then they're going to come back regretting their decision that they made. And then um, they're going to work towards reconciliation. So the justice is going to be served in this connection for sure. But yes, I feel like, you know, it's a soulmate connection. It can never be the case where, um, you know, maybe, maybe it doesn't have to be your person left you for another person. It can be they left you for their work. They left you for their family, maybe. Uh, they left you for their passion for something else, maybe their career or something. But I don't think that the gap, the time apart from each other is going to be long. It can be long for some of you, but I don't think it will be so long for you to deal with. Uh, where you get, you know, kind of um, un annoyed enough to leave this person and move on. I feel like, you know, one person is going to leave the other person and the other person would know that they are going to come back very soon. And that is going to happen very soon. I feel like, you know, the person coming back is happening very quick. Like, you know, even if it's uh, happened for you in the past and now you're waiting for the reconciliation, the reconciliation is definitely coming in very quick. Uh, plus, you know, it's it's more of that energy where, you know, if, if you had uh, you had two, two choices to make, uh, one is your passion for work and the other is your love life. If you are going to choose your love life, maybe in the future you're going to regret, I wish I had chosen my work passions too. 
but then if you chose your work passion and then whatever you wanted to experience whatever you wanted to explore there you did and then you choosing your love life then at least you would not blame your person or blame your love life that because of which you could not pursue the passion that you had for the specific goal of yours since you since you were a child you had this goal to become a so and so so i feel like you know it's more of that thing where god has planned things a certain way because if you had come together with your person earlier maybe you're going to blame this person for being the reason why you could not pursue your career path but now when you are making a u turn towards your person you would know that you thought that maybe your passion is going to bring you happiness but it did not maybe that's the energy of your person once they're going to experience that they're going to find that it wasn't something that they wanted it wasn't the happiness that they were seeking they they get the happiness being with you and that's going to be the moment when they are going to come forward doing the things to win you back over now that is something which god planned you know if if you went through this whole situation the way you planned for it i feel like you know you you would have regretted that later on because your person might have chosen to leave you then and go for work because they would have felt exactly the opposite for their work passion but now it's it's like you know they value you more they love you more they understand you more they understand the connection more and now they will be returning i feel like you know that's something which has to happen before you could come together but the answer is a big yes yes you are going to end up together because you are soulmates and yes you you will be having time apart from each other but then the universe is going to bring you back together in a way where you are going to value each other and love each other forever more let's see these cards what these cards have to add a time to give rather than take i feel like you know for majority of you you will have to give time and space to your person uh and let them go if they want to go if they want to pursue something else let them let them free set them free because uh, if you hold them if you try not to let them go uh they will never value you so just let them go if they want to go let them go they will come back to you just have control uh, uh sorry complete faith around it uh don't let your past hold you back i feel like you know it's uh, it's it's more of a uh, if you have fears because of the past situations try not to let that hold you back just know that what is yours will be yours till forever and this person whoever it is that you are dealing with whoever it is that you're talking about here or asking about here this person and you are meant to be so if you are meant to be no matter what happens in between you are still going to be together eventually you are coming up together you are ending up together so just let things happen when the time is right everything is going to fall into place your dreams need a practical plan i feel like you know your person whoever it is that uh, that you were dealing with or whoever it is that you are dealing with that person had so many dreams to pursue but they didn't have a practical plan to go about it and that's why they are ending up feeling lost without you even though they felt maybe the green uh, the grass is green on the other end but then when they you know left you they realized that no it wasn't the case so i feel like you know it's 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 that kind of a situation that you might be dealing with right now or it will be happening so for you in coming future um but yes this is a soulmate connection and yes you will end up together no matter what happens no matter what goes in between between the two of you you are going to be together forever so while you wait i i don't see to be very honest i don't see that uh, the one who is going to be on the waiting side will have any worries around it why because they will have a strong faith in their love they will have that inner knowing and they will not be worrying around you know will that person come back or not so uh, there is a complete faith that this person is having be that you or the person that you are dealing with so yeah i hope it was of help and uh, yeah if you are willing to purchase any of the services that i offer check the description box for the details on that till i do the next reading for you guys take care bye